acids and bases react with metals. This activity will help us understand the chemical properties of acids and bases when they react with metals. Take about 5 milliliters of dilute sulfuric acid, or H2SO4, in a test tube and add a few zinc granules to it. You will observe some gas coming from the surface of the zinc granules. Pass the gas to the soap solution. You will observe bubbles forming in the soap solution. Now, take a burning candle near the gas. You will observe that the gas burns with a pop sound. Repeat the activity with other acids such as hydrochloric acid, nitric acid, and ethanol and observe the reactions. Note that the metal in the above reaction displaces hydrogen from the acid. This is seen in the form of hydrogen gas. The metal combines with the reaming part of the acid and forms a compound called salt. Thus, the reaction of the metal with the acid is acid plus metal equals salt plus hydrogen gas. Now let's perform another activity. Place a few granules of the same metal in a test tube. Add around 2 milliliters of sodium hydroxide solution and warm the contents of the test tube. Repeat the same steps as in the previous activity. If you use sodium hydroxide as the acid, you will observe that the reaction that takes place is sodium hydroxide plus zinc equals sodium zincate plus hydrogen, or 2NaOH plus Zn is equal to Na2ZnO2 plus H2. As before, hydrogen is found in the reaction. However, such reactions are not possible with all metals. Thus, through this activity, we can understand that the products of the reactions between acids and metals are usually salt and hydrogen gas.